God, come to our aid. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Alleluia. Blessed are the pure in heart, for they shall be our God. The secret of the Lord is theirs, their soul is Christ's abode. The Lord who left the heavens, our life and peace to bring, to dwell in lowliness with men their pattern and their king. Still to the lowly soul he does himself in part, and for his dwelling and his throne choose as the pure in heart. Lord, we thy presence see, may ours this blessing be. Give us a pure and lowly heart, a temple fit for thee. The Lord is my love and my refuge, in him I place my trust. Bless me the Lord my rock, who trains my arms for battle, who prepares my hands for war. He is my love, my fortress, he is my stronghold, my saviour, my shield, my place of refuge. He brings peoples under my rule. Lord, what is man that you care for him? What all man that you keep him in mind? Man who is merely a breath, whose life fades like a shadow. Lo, your heavens and come down. Touch the mountains, wreathe them in smoke. Flash your lightnings, rout the foe. Shoot your arrows and put them to fly. Reach down from heaven and save me. Draw me out from the mighty waters. From the hands of alien foes whose mouths are filled with lies, whose hands are raised in perjury. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to his Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. The Lord is my love and my refuge. In him I place my trust. Blessed the people whose God is the Lord. To your God will I sing a new song. I will play on the ten string tower. To you who give kings their victory, who set David your servant free, you set him free from the evil sword, you rescued him from alien foes, whose mouths were filled with lies, whose hands were raised in perjury. Let our sons then flourish like saplings, grown tall and strong from their youth. Our daughters graceful as columns, adorned as though for a palace. Let our barns be filled to overflowing, 
with crops of every kind. Our sheep increasing by thousands, myriads of sheep in our fields, our cattle heavy with young. No ruined wall, no exile, no sound of weeping in our streets. Have the people with such blessings, have the people whose God is the Lord. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to His Son, Jesus Christ the Lord. To the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. Blessed the people whose God is the Lord. Victory and empire have now been won by our God. We give thanks to you, Lord God Almighty, who are and who were, that you have taken your great power and begun to reign. The nations rage, but your wrath came, and the time for the dead to be judged, for rewarding your servants, the prophets and saints, and those who fear your name, both small and great. Now the salvation and the power, and the kingdom of our God, and the authority of his Christ have come. For the accuser of our brethren has been thrown down, who accuses them day and night before our God. And they have conquered him by the blood of the Lamb, and by the word of their testimony, for they love not their lives, even unto death. Rejoice then, O heaven, and you that dwell therein. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Victory and empire have now been won by our God. You must, of course, continue faithful on a sure and firm foundation and not allow your souls to be shaken from the hope you gained when you heard the gospel, which has been preached to everybody in the world. The Lord is my shepherd, there is nothing I shall want. The Lord is my shepherd, there is nothing I shall want. Fresh and green are the pastures, where he gives me repose. The Lord is my shepherd, there is nothing I shall want. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The Lord is my shepherd, there is nothing I shall want. The Lord is satisfied and filled with good things, those who hungered for justice. My soul glorifies the Lord, my spirit rejoices in God my Saviour. He looks on his servant in a lowliness. Henceforth all ages will call me blessed. The Almighty works marvels for me. Holy his name. His mercy is from age to age. On those who fear him. He puts forth his arm in strength and scatters the proud hearted. He casts the mighty from their thrones and raises the lowly. He fills the starving with good things, sends the rich away empty. He protects his really servant, remembering his mercy. 
the mercy promised to our fathers, to Abraham and his sons forever. Praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, both now and forever, world without end. The Lord is satisfied and filled with good things, those who hungered for justice. The light shines out in the darkness, and the darkness cannot overcome it. Let us thank our Lord for bringing his light to our lives. Lord Jesus Christ, you are our light. Word of God, you have brought the light of eternity to the darkened world. May it open the minds and hearts of all the children of the church. Lord Jesus Christ, you are our light. Show your care for all who dedicate their lives to the service of others. May your grace inspire their actions and sustain them to the end. Lord Jesus Christ, you are our light. Lord, you healed the paralytic and forgave him his sins. Pardon all our guilt and heal the wounds of our sins. Lord Jesus Christ, you are our light. Men follow the light to new knowledge and discovery. May they use your gifts to serve the whole human family and so give glory to you. Lord Jesus Christ, you are our light. Lead the dead from darkness into your own wonderful light. In your mercy, show them the radiance of your glory. Lord Jesus Christ, you are our light. At the Saviour's command, and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Listen favourably to our evening prayer, Lord, and grant that as we follow your Son's example, we may by perseverance yield a harvest of, harvest of good works. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, Forever and ever. Amen. The Lord bless us and keep us from all evil and bring us to everlasting life. Amen.